The Fifth Circuit has ordered the Louisiana legislature to try again to pass a congressional district map that complies with the Voting Rights Act. They, they've had ample opportunities to, to do the right thing, but, you know, if this is what it takes uh, to get to, the, to, to get to a map of two black districts, then, then, then so be it. While the merits of the original map were not ruled on, the court says that it likely violated the law by only having one black majority district, despite the state population being one third black. The court says that the process must be done by next May for the map to be implemented for the fall congressional election. If the Supreme Court had not ruled in favor of black voters in Alabama, we certainly would have seen the Fifth Circuit, um, you know, ruling on our on, on our side. And I don't think you would see some of the other elected officials in, in, in Louisiana, um, you know, now speaking as if they're going to pass a, a, a map that we've been asking for. The question now is which governor will call the legislature in. Governor John Bell Edwards has the power to call the members who pass the map or Governor-elect Jeff Landry can call the new lawmakers. Landry says he's willing to do that, but he faces an impossible January 15th deadline set by the court. If the majority in the legislature and the new governor want to make a good faith attempt at passing a fair map that has two majority black districts um, and they're not able to comply with that January 15th deadline and they ask for additional time, we would certainly not object to that. For your local election headquarters, I'm Shannon Hecht.